Okay, uh, it's Brennan again uh, for another daily video. Now, um, I'm here in Bloomington again like I was yesterday. And um, I'm going to talk about something that happened to me while I was here and um, what that means to me and uh, just advice to you guys about motivation. So last night I met George Talaferro. Uh, you guys can look him up. I'm sure you'll be able to find him on Wikipedia or something like that. But uh, basically he was a football star in uh, around 1940, 1950. And um, he went to the NFL. He was very successful in college. Like, I don't know much about football, but he was just, he was really fucking good, like, and, um, he also was, uh, you know, he had to face the challenges of segregation when he was in school at Indiana University, so, um, we got to talk to him on our tour, or our orientation yesterday, uh, us students did, us freshmen, incoming freshmen, so, um, I'm just going to talk about, you know, some of the advice he gave me because I asked him, he said, one of the things you need to do in your life is you need to be the best, he said he's going to do two things for you and you should do two things for him. You should be always honest and truthful to him and you should always try to be the best human being that you can possibly be. And he said if you do those two things, you know, that's what he does. And he thinks that everyone should do that. So, I mean, that makes a lot of sense to me. And I think that I agree with that. But um, my problem, and probably a lot of people's problem, is uh, motivation. How do you get motivated to be the best person you can be? That's a very hard goal. That's a very difficult thing to accomplish. But uh, I asked him this and, you know, he, he kind of didn't answer for like 15 seconds and um, I wasn't sure if he was just, and he was like kind of taking pictures with other people at the same time, so I'm not sure if he was just trying to blow off my question when I first asked it because he seemed like he was like unresponsive. Uh, but he actually was just thinking really hard about this, you know, what motivate, like, what motivates me, what can I tell people about motivation, and after he thought for a little bit, he told me this, you have to love what you see in the mirror. That is the number one motivational secret that I can tell you guys, and it's the one that I'm going to use in my own life uh, to motivate me, because... If you love what you see in the mirror, you want to keep going, but also if you don't love what you see in the mirror, you want to get to that point where you do love what you see in the mirror. And this isn't only about your physical image, of course. It's the person looking back at you. What, how do you judge that person? And I've heard other people say this before in videos, and well, not this specifically, but uh, an idea like this that Basically, all that matters in life is self-respect. If you can respect the person looking back at you, that's what matters. You know, if you can truthfully respect that person, if you truthfully believe that you're a good person, that you, you know, you're the shit, well, I think that's what one of the main goals should be in your life, is to get to a point where you can look in the mirror and you can be proud of the person you see. You can be happy to see that person and know that that person is you. Uh, so that's basically all I have for this video. Um, stay motivated, guys. Um, you know, it's hard to be motivated, but with things like this, I think it makes it a lot easier when you think about things like this. So um, thanks for watching the video. Um, if you liked it, please give it a like. If you have any comments or questions, put them in the comments section. I'll check it regularly. Um, if you like my videos, if you enjoy watching my videos, I encourage you to subscribe. So uh, thanks for watching.